Authorities in Russia have made five arrests in the ongoing investigation into the murder of Boris Nemtsov, an outspoken critic of the Kremlin. To tell us more, Paul E. is joining us from the News Center. Paul, the killing of Russia's leading opposition activist continues to stir controversy. What details have authorities released on these men? Well, all five suspects are said to be Chechen from Russia's predominantly Muslim northern Caucasus. Two of them, including an ex policeman, have been charged with murder by a Moscow court. However, Nipsov's closest allies are rejecting the narrative that his death was a result of religious extremism, but rather a politically motivated terror attack. Hadeon's Khan Kim reports. A Moscow court has charged two men accused of plotting to kill Russian opposition leader Boris Nemtsov, an outspoken Kremlin critic. Zaur Dadaev, a former police officer who fought Islamic insurgents, admitted he was involved in the killing, while the second suspect, Anzor Gubashev, pleaded innocent. Russian state television showed the men's arrival in court wearing handcuffs and covering their faces. Three other suspects have been jailed. And all five men are of Chechen origin, which could potentially be a sensitive issue in Russia, as many Russians view Chechens as violent extremists. A sixth suspect reportedly blew himself up with a grenade in a standoff with police in the Chechen capital of Grozny. Nemtsov was assassinated in late February, days before he was set to address a major anti-government rally. He was also to publish a report on the Russian military's involvement in the war in Ukraine, despite Moscow's denial that it has supplied separatists with troops and weapons. The biggest question now is who ordered Nemtsov's assassination? Some of his supporters have gone so far as to say the Russian government was behind the killing. Russian officials deny that, and President Vladimir Putin has condemned the killing and pledged to do everything to find and prosecute the killers. Nemtsov's shooting is the most high-profile killing of an opposition figure since Putin came to power in 2000. Connie Kim, Adirang News.